Hey, I stick you here with an Apple Tech video to update. This is for the new updated iMac. Yeah, there's a new updated iMac. Uh, the 24 inch model uh, an Apple Store is down and it just got back up. They updated them. Uh, so let me go down the roll here. You see, like, your two 20 inch models and your two 24. Now you have two 24 inch models that you can get here. Now, with 20 inch, you still have your basic configuration. So it only goes up to 750 gigs. Uh, still 4 gigs of RAM at the max. Everything else is pretty much still stationary. It stays the same. But now you have a new option with the new 24 inch uh, iMac, which we're upgraded. Um, now they're still at the same dazzling displays, you know. 24, 20 inch. Now, now you have a new option with a 24 inch though that includes new NVIDIA GeForce, well not new, the NVIDIA GeForce 8800 GS. It's enjoy up to 2.2 times faster graphics performance than the actual 20 inch one. So that's only uh, available in 24 inch. You also have an Intel Core 2 Deuteronomy processor and the Henry models. So these are moving from the I forgot what they're called. Is it Maya? I don't think it was Maya, but now they're on to the Penring processor. They show great improvements in applications, all the stuff, the whole system altogether. Now, we already see these new Penrings in the MacBook Pro, the MacBook. And just as uh, just as talked about, Apple has updated the iMac, guys. Uh, it's still the all same, same slim one design. Though you are getting um, now 3.06 gigahertz. It used to be 2.8, but the new Pender processor, you're able to go up to 3.06 gigahertz. Guys, that's fast. That's about, uh, you can, uh, so that's, like, you know, 3.06 gigahertz. That's basically, you know, the Mac, the Mac Pro can go up to 3.06 Two, I believe so. You're getting a lot out of that iMac. It's a really, really fast machine. Uh, you can go 500 gigabyte hard drive standard now. Uh, you can go up to one terabyte. It has the new NVIDIA process, uh, 8800 GS with 512 megabytes of VRAM. So much more updated VRAM from 256 to 512. And uh, the price now that for the 3.06, 2 gigs, 500. Uh, NVIDIA is only $2,199. If you ask me guys, that's an actually great price, great model price. Now the 2.8 is standing now at $1,799. So you can, uh, not much to spec really. Uh, you can get it either with 2 gigs, 4 gigs, 500 hard drive space, 750 or 1 terabyte, 24 inch. Uh, you're still getting the 8 uh, double layer super drive. So, you know, there's not a lot more to customize now besides software and, you know, modem, and mouse and keyboard, all the other accessories, but Apple has delivered uh, great updates with these pen and processors, and hopefully we're looking into seeing the Mac Mini and the Mac Mini take, take on this um, processor, possibly, uh, who knows, in the future, maybe the MacBook Air, but who knows about that. Anyways, so far it's been the MacBook, the MacBook Pro, and the iMac. Uh, Mac Mini is all left for the Penrin for the Penrin migration for all the Apple products. So we see great, in, you know, great, great speed increases. And uh, I know I'm planning on getting an iMac, and it's just new deal I'm thinking on making. Basically, by this holiday or my birthday, if I get, uh, I'm trying to make this deal now. I'm trying. If I get. I've gotten good grades throughout the quarter when school ends by this summer. So far, I've all A's and all you know all that stuff. And if I get that throughout and achieve all those good grades and uh, get honor roll again, I think that would be mine. It's either this thing where you get honor roll from first grade, I think, to all the way up to sixth grade, you get something called presidential. I got that last year. And if you get something this year, I, don't know, I forget what you get, but if I can achieve that until uh, maybe after summer. Or possibly during summer, I'll uh, talk to my dad and think about getting me an iMac. Now, I'm going to pay for uh, some of it as well. My mom will chip in and my dad will chip in, of course. But uh, I'm going to try and pay as much as I can. Uh, either that or match me up. But what I am going to do is if I do get that, I'm going to try and either sell the desktop or sell, sell some of my stuff around here to, you know, get some more money in. Uh, or either that or move my desktop into my parents' room so they have a computer and I can just use the iMac here. So I'm looking forward to that. And also for, um, uh, what do you call that? For Christmas time around the holidays, which is still a long time ago, and my birthday, which is after the holidays, 
if I don't get anything, like any presents or anything like that, then maybe just get the iMac is what I'm working on. And so far, I mean, it sounds like a good deal. So basically, I have to keep grades, uh, grades, Christmas, and my birthday. If I don't get anything for those, just you know, all all three of those events for just for the iMac. Now I'm thinking I want to get a 24-inch model, but uh, you know that's going to be pushing out the price. But uh, like I, I'll use it, you know, basically it'll be for me, but I'll share it with the family, of course. Now, if I'm going to get one, hopefully I want the 2.8 gigahertz. But now this 3.0 is out. If I can, I'll try and aim for the 3.0. Uh, probably two gigs of RAM, and I'll upgrade it myself. So yeah, guys. Uh, now station model for the 24 inches, 500 gigabytes. You have the new Nvidia, so that's just going to be, you know, smoother gaming, higher frames. Per second, all that stuff, guys, and uh, with 10.5.2 out, the gaming performance is already seen increasing. So, you know, graphics for the Mac, as we know, is going up, and the price is pretty. Uh, I like the price for this now. If you want to get it uh, for paying for a monthly fee, it would be $52 per month, I think, it's a year to achieve that. So, I'll have to look into that as well. Anyways, guys, that's all for this Apple tech update. It's a little long one, but um, 3.06 gigahertz for the Mac iMac and um, more VRAM for the new NVIDIA GeForce 8800GS. Anyways guys, that's all for this Apple Tech update. Uh, if you want to check out the Apple updates, just head over to apple.com or apple.com slash iMac and check them out. Anyways guys, thanks for watching.